everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, a big, big welcome to you. My name is Shelly. So today we're gonna talk about scalp, scalp health. I'm about to moisturize and oil my scalp, so I figure I'll come on here and show you guys um, what I do and why I do it and what products I use. Um, so let's get straight into it. Um, first of all, let's talk about the fact that my hair has like grown. <laughs> Um, it's just crazy to me. Anyway, um, so um, first I want to say that um, I have reached, I have um, uh, reached like about two weeks ago and got my hair um, uh, in two strand twist. I like when I have access to my scalp. That way I can really get into, um, into I can get the products and stuff directly into my scalp. So in between my 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 wash. Um, uh, I, my wash intervals when I have twist in I can get directly into it so um, that's when I really 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 pay attention to what I'm doing um, so I'm gonna divide my hair into two parts um, and work and work uh, you know section by section um, I will say though that the first part of, of um, uh, or the most important part of a healthy scalp or healthy scalp routine is to make sure that you have clean scalp. You, all these products I'm about to show you that I'm using means nothing if your scalp is dirty. So you're basically putting products on dirty scalp. It makes no sense. Um, so make sure that your hair is washed properly. Make sure that your wash routine is on point. And I'll put a video of my wash routine so you can see what I do. Um, but just make sure that your scalp is clean. Clarify your scalp with a clarifying, clarifying shampoo. Then go in with a moisturizing shampoo. Um, and just make sure that your scalp is clean. Can't stress it enough. Then we're gonna add products, right? Um, and in between your your wash intervals, you make sure that your scalp is moisturized and um, and oiled, right? Um, so the products I'm gonna be using, not a lot, but the most the most important and the cheapest one of every of all is water. And I'm using um, the spray bottle from Amazon. I'll put a link to it where you can get this. Super 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 dirt cheap, um, but I like it because it's very it's like you know the continuous mist. Um, so I missed my, my whole, my whole hair, but not, you know, not a lot, um, cause it's not really dry, but I'm focusing on scalp today. So we're gonna, we're gonna, um, moisturize our scalp first, um, with water. And I find that it's like the oils do more for me when I add oil to, um, to, you know moisturized um, scalp and then the oil is like seal it in so I always like wet my my scalp first if you have a fresh retwist that's not in two strand twist and you don't want your hair to unravel go in smaller sections so I have my hair in two parts and you could probably go in four so like pin this pin one part up and just work um, with this piece so that you don't um, you don't unravel your 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 fresh retwist right so you work into parts and maybe even cut it even smaller um, and hold your hair taut when you do it so say for example this was not into strand twist and I, and I just have a regular retwist I would hold this taut and spray it moisturize my scalp do everything that I'm doing while holding it so I can keep it taut um, and then when I'm done um, you know, I can probably just, you know, do like a, like a big, big twist or something just to hold it and pin it away kind of thing. Um, cause I don't want you to, you know, that, you know, unravel your retwist that you probably paid, you know, a lot of money for or use, or you spent a lot of time doing, right? Um, so I already, uh, misted my, my hair and my scalp. I'm going to go in with a leave-in conditioner. For now, for today, I'm using a Dr. Locke's Jinan leave-in conditioner. You guys know I already love I love um, Dr. Luck stuff, so this is um, uh, one of my favorites. An alternative, because um, this, this is quite expensive, so I have to give you an alternative. An alternative is the Argon um, Cream of Nature Argan Oil um, Leave-In Conditioner. I've um, I reviewed that before, and I'll put a link to one of the videos that I talk about that. Um, you can get it at Target for like four dollars. This. I don't remember what this is, but does that mean the 16? Um, but um, I, I love this, but I know that that one also makes my hair feel really good. Um, and again, I do the same thing. I do my scalp and then I do my hair and make sure that I get it all in. And something that I learned from the um, the Digital Loctician um, YouTube channel, and I put a link to her channel um, 
below is to never like moisturize where you're just, like spritz your hair and stuff at night because you shouldn't go to your bed with damp hair <laughs> and i used to moisturize my hair at night but now i don't do that i do that in the morning or in the daytime um just to make sure that i have good nice healthy locks okay so we have the leave-in conditioner in now we're gonna go in with oils right i use a couple things um i'm using the yaya oil from dr locks very very light oil i love light oils another light oil this is not it but this is the bottle um is the alike naturals essential 17 hair growth oil you can get at target i kept the bottle because i like the spout so in here i have a couple things this is my i use this for my my mixology situation so i have black castor oil um sweet almond oil what else do i have in here argan oil um, and then I add a tea tree oil to it, right? So this is my tea tree oil. Love, love, love tea tree oil. I have scalp eczema, so it's like my holy grail um, for in my itchy scalp. Um, but before, just before I go in with oils, I use this doctor, um, not doctor, um, head and shoulders. Let me see if you can see that. Head and shoulders instant soothe scalp elixir. And this is from the Royal Oils collection of head and shoulders. Royal Oils, um, and this is the blue. Every, anywhere you see the blue one, just know it's for you. <laughs> um, the blue packaging uh, from Head & Shoulders is made by Black Scientist. Um, so so they, it's made with, with oil hair type or scalp type or everything in mind. So when you see the blue um, labels uh, or packaging, you know that it's made for you versus the white one. Okay? All right, so this one I go in, um, I spray my scalp first because it, it, it basically helps with the itchy, itchiness. If you don't have itchy scalp, you don't need this, but I have scalp eczema, so I unfortunately have to do more than some people. So if you don't need this, you can just skip this, this step. Um, it smells really nice too. Um, sometimes it runs down the, the shaft of my, <laughs> of my, my locks, but it's okay. Um, and then I just massage that in. Yeah. All right. And remember, if you have um, a fresh retwist that's not in two strand twist, then you um, you do it. You do this in much smaller parts. Hold your hair taut while you do all of this, so that you don't mess up your your fresh retwist. And then you can like twist it. And pin it up and pin it apart um, and you know pin it away when you're like done with your um oil and moisturizing um okay and then i go in with um yaya oil or my mix mixology thing so the yaya oil i really do like it let me tell you what's in it it's avocado oil so all the oils that i like is in here avocado oil grapeseed oil sweet almond oil jojoba oil argan oil uh sea kelp not sure what that is Chamomile oil, vitamin E, um, grapefruit oil, and lemon oil. It smells really good. It's a super light oil. The fact that you can spray it, I like the spout. I like the spout of like most of Dr. Locke stuff, but um, if you look, I can spray the oil out of here. If you if if you have a heavy oil, you can't use a spout like this. So I like the light. I like light oils because it it doesn't it doesn't cause buildup. And people think that oils can't give you buildup. They can. <laughs> Especially like um, castor oil. If you st if you use a straight castor oil on your scalp, trust me, you're gonna have buildup. That's why I like to mix it with other things. Um, but this oil is really really light. I love it a lot. Um, I just put it all over my scalp, massage it in. And remember again, if you have a fresh retwist, hold it taut and do your moisturizing and your oiling and separating and all that stuff. Um, which your which your you know while you're holding it taut, um, but this is really 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 good. Today I'm not gonna use this, but I wanted to sh I just wanted to tell you what I had my in my mix mixology bottle, um, and because I'm using this today, I don't need to go in with anything tea tree oil because this is a this this has a peppermint peppermint oil in it and menthol and, and a whole bunch of other things that will do the same thing that the tea tree oil does. Um, so I'm just using the Yaya oil and it's super light like I said before love it love it um, and then I just make sure that the sh that the the length of my locks 
also gets um, gets it. Sometimes I spray it directly on my on my locks, but um, I also also like to spray it in my hand. And if I show you, let me see. Hopefully, you can. See. I don't know if you can. See. Oh, it's like super light. I just wanted to show you how light <laughs> how light it is. Um, but I spray it in my hand and then squeeze it in my locks and give it a nice shine. Like seriously, my hair have grown, boy. It's just so so crazy to me. Um, I just had a child. Um, I had a, my second um, baby like two months ago, so um, I don't have time to deal with my hair. <laughs> so I did when I went to get my hair washed from um, at the at the salon. I was I was just like put it into a strand twist so I don't have so it would make my retwist last longer and I will get more access to my scalp so. Um, I can just, you know, make sure that there's no flakes that's coming in and, um, see how nice and clean my scalp is? And this, this is a two week, a two week retwist, but I'm trying my best to like, you know, keep it covered and stuff, which has been hard throughout my pregnancy. Um, oh my God, I have length everywhere in my hair. Please cover your hair <laughs> because, um, I'm gonna, I'm, I'll talk about this in a whole different video, but I'm gonna have to dye my hair black. Because I have, uh, let me see if I can find something to show you. I have lint everywhere, build up. That you can't, you see this? You can't get that out. You see that? You cannot get lint out of your hair unless you pick it out. And then if you pick it out, then it's gonna be um, you weaken, you weakening the your lock. So that's not even a question. So unfortunately, because of my me neglecting my hair and my scalp. And everything throughout my pregnancy, um, I now have to pay for it. So I'm gonna do the same thing to this side: water, leave-in conditioner, oil. Simple, right? Going with my elixir, my scalp, rub it through. And I really love the loctician that I went to. If you're in New York, um, um. Uh, Napstar is um, is the the salon I went to. Oh, also, let me show you. I also bought their um, when I went to get my hair done. I bought the the oil that they have that they use in my hair. Um, I think I paid like thirty dollars. Quite expensive, <laughs> um, but I like it because it's it's a really light oil and has a little dropper thing. Um, in here they have um, they have castor seed oil. Um, they have avocado oil, sweet almond oil, all the oils I like again, <laughs> grapeseed oil, um, lavender oil, it's just the light stuff, so I, I, I like this as well. Um, just wanted to show you that. But if you're in New York, um, you, you can try that lactation, um, uh, salon, there's like two of them in the city. I really, 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 really love, um, enjoyed my time there, um, and it was just a really, really good experience. All right, and then I'm gonna go with my Yaya oil, my scalp, and put some in my hand, rub it up, and, and squeeze it into the, into the lock. And I just wanna stress that scalp health is like, so so important and I think it's I think we focus on our locks and not much not so much or um, not so much or um, or here I mean sorry what scalp <laughs> um, but I just want want us to really focus on the scalp because at the end of the day like that's where the hair grows you know um, and if you have scalp eczema or any kind of scalp condition like I do um, then focusing on your scalp is like a must okay yeah so you see like it's all nice and juicy now <laughs> yeah so um, even though we're focusing on scalp the hair also gets a little bit of you know love um, but yeah that's pretty much what I do see pretty easy right um, and again you take advantage of when you of when you have like 
you know clean scalp where you can actually physically get into it if you don't have clean if you know i mean when i say clean scalp i mean like you know um a retwist or something where you have direct access if you don't then just you did you know separate separate your um your locks and and work your fingers in and make sure that your scalp is getting all of the goodness that you put in there um again these are the products i use nothing is sponsored here this is just what i spend my money on what i use um i just want you to um to have options too if you've never tried any of these stuff um but i really really like the little you know concoction that i put together super super love this line um i think i'm gonna try the shampoo next i've never tried i, didn't, I haven't tried the shampoo before the pre-cleanse i did um i, I tried the pre-cleanse i like it but I don't see the difference between that one and the Dr. Locks pre-cleanse, but I'll use both of them. I mean, they're both black owned, so uh, I like to spend my coins that way. Um, so yeah, but anyway, focus on your scalp. Make sure your scalp is clean. Then go in with your with your moisturizing um, uh, sprays or your water, um, and then you follow up with your oil, which seals everything in and make your scalp juicy and nice. Um, so yeah, but that's what I wanted to share with you guys. Um, what I use, share it in the comment section below. Um, what your scalp routine is, because I think we can all learn from each other, right? Um, so that would be really beneficial to everybody and also to me too. I am no pro, y'all know that. <laughs> Um, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.